Good morning, it's uh, Tuesday, a little bit after 8 o'clock here, November 20th. This is the crusher that's sitting at my home here in Clearwater, Minnesota. Freshly sandblasted and painted about two months ago. Come over here and uh, fire it up. Turn the key on and should preheat. Oh yeah, not too cold. I've seen it as much as 30 seconds when it's really cold. Turn the key here. 17 degrees is the water temperature. Start right up. Up a little bit, pull it warms up. We got oil pressures up to 55 pounds. 14 volts of battery. I'm gonna let this warm up before I run it. I'll pause this video and I'll come back after a bit here, but we'll just walk around it. It's got good tires on it. Original, of course. I mean, it probably don't have, but oh, I don't know, maybe 10,000 miles. It's been drug around Minnesota here for the last oh, 13, 14 years. I had uh, new brakes and drums put on the rear axle here. They were getting a little worn. I thought somebody in California maybe wanted this, and I figured it'd probably be best if it had some good brakes to go over the mountains. So. Okay, I'll pause this video and we'll come back after it warms up a bit. Power light will come on. It is ready to go, so I will hit the up button. Deck is closed. Well, the guide posts still got paint on them, so that'll change once we run it. We'll hit the up button. Shuts off. Now I'll hit the down button. Get 
I'm going to put it down, I'm going to show you the pressure gauges when it kicks itself out. time. I always shut the lid when I'm done. up to 174 degrees. Oil pressure at idle on its worm is 37. Batteries 14.2 volts. Go ahead and shut it off. Oil capacity is full. It's got fresh oil in it. All the filters have been changed. 